So we're looking at the heart. When you look at the heart, you've got to be sure you understand the anterior and the posterior side. So get used to seeing this as anterior and this as posterior. Okay? The heart has four different chambers to it. We have two atria on top. We have two ventricles below. So the easiest way to learn this is to follow blood flow through the heart. Okay? So where I'm going to start is the superior vena cava and the inferior vena cava. This is painted blue because it's carrying deoxygenated blood. So superior vena cava, inferior vena cava lead into the right atrium. From there, blood goes into the right ventricle. From there, that deoxygenated blood goes up the pulmonary trunk, out the left pulmonary artery, and as you can see on this side, out the right pulmonary artery. This is an artery, but it's carrying deoxygenated blood to the lungs. We're looking at the posterior side now. From the lungs, we drop off carbon dioxide, pick up oxygen, and that oxygenated blood comes in through the pulmonary veins. This would be the right superior and inferior pulmonary vein, the left superior and inferior pulmonary vein. This is oxygenated blood traveling on veins into the left atrium. We turn this around. Blood then, oxygenated blood, goes from the left atrium to the left ventricle, and from the left ventricle up the ascending aorta and the aortic arch, and then starts to distribute throughout the body at the brachiocephalic trunk, the left common carotid, and the left subclavian arteries.